If you happen to see a large group of men decked out in suits this weekend, you might want to stop and take a few notes. Some business owners in Detroit are calling on men across the community to get dressed up in their finest for the 100 Men in Suits event on the Avenue of Fashion, of course. Demond Fernandez learned it's as much about showcasing men's style as it is about unity. You know, fashion is a big thing. Detroit is known for dressing. And when it comes to fashion in Detroit, there's a reason folks call Livernois the avenue of fashion. Well, fashion was something that was always embedded in me from my family. Just ask Algernard Bartel about style and fashion. He's an entrepreneur with five retail shops along Livernois, including Times Square men's custom clothing. Everything is an occasion for Detroit. We dress up for everything. And speaking of occasions, Bartel's encouraging men across the city to start picking out their finest threads and heading on over to Livernois Avenue this Sunday, May 26th, for the 100 Men in Suits event. I was thinking about the Met Gala or the thing that they have in New York about the fashion, and I say, man, I'm going to create something here in Detroit. 100 Men in Suits is where men are decked out and dressed to impress. Bartel says its mission is to eliminate stereotypes about the everyday man, and that's not it. A unique purpose for this, too, is not just about fashion. It's about unity, too. It's about unity. That's the theme of it, unity in the community, because nice. that's what we want to bring. 100 Men in Suits is now approaching its fourth year, and Bartel says the event continues growing, and spectators will be lining the streets supporting the well-dressed men. We have an avenue. The, the the sidewalks are wider, so we roll out the red carpet, and people bring their A-game. And fellows of all ages are getting involved, strutting down the street in their finest. And what we do, doing, we try to mentor these younger guys. And as much as 100 Men in Suits is about motivating and supporting fellas in the community, it's also about bragging rights. Bartel says a group of judges will be present, and the best-dressed gent wins a custom suit from his shop while sending a strong message. You look good, you feel good, you can think good, right? So that's how I think. If you look good, you feel good, you can think good about yourself. All right, and the 100 Men in Suits event is Sunday from 3 to 5 on Livernois. It'll all go down right in front of the Times Square's men's clothing. And Devin, the organizers tell me it's truly a parade of fashion yeah. that uh, you definitely have to witness up close. I love this. So is this open to anyone, or is there some kind of criteria to be in it? All right, good question. So the organizers tell me any man can join. All you have to do is show up and participate. But they do say the competition is going to be tight, and you and must no show doubt. up. Yeah. And, and look, they said you've got to show up with your A game. That's right. Right. They're also saying this about community service, too. So they're also urging everyone, participants and even spectators, to come with a canned goods so that it can be donated to a local oh, food pantry. Great. And get this, Devin, they tell me that the competition is so tight, they even go down to the finest detail of the interior lining of oh, your suit. Yes, it yes. has to be on point if you want to win. I love it. That's really great. Well, you know, ZZ Top told us women go crazy for a sharp-dressed man, so <laughs> get out the there truth. and be one of the hundred. I love it, Devon. That's great Thanks. stuff.